Be strong enough to let go and be wise enough to wait for what you deserve. Good morning to all. Today, I, Anand Khatun of Nirmala Higher Secondary School, Moatura, is here to say a few words about inhuman side of India. Before, India was known for its rich cultural diversity. But today, India is known for its crimes. Crimes of India includes rape, sexual assault, indecency, insult to modesty and what not. Police records of India shows crimes against women in India. The most common crime against women in India is rape. In most of the rape cases, the culprit is known to the victim. Dowries are also considered as a major contributor towards violence against women. India's women abuse is the biggest human right violation on earth. The culturally sanctioned degradation of women in India is so complete that the PM of India, Narendra Modi, launched a national program called Beti Bachao. Women of India are traumatized in less obvious ways than by tanks in streets, warlords and bombs. Government survey shows that 42% of the girls of the country have been sexually abused. A woman whose sense of self has been worn down by the definition that must depend on others which only serves to breed fear and violence. A strong woman knows she has the strength enough for the journey, but a woman of strength knows that it is in the journey that she becomes strong. Each time a woman stands up and protests, it is not just for her, but for the all other women who are being abused. Thus, I would like to conclude by giving a message to the inhuman men of India that Every time you mistreat a woman, you are giving up the right to be treated as a man. Thank you.